right. because you touch yourself at night. Yeah, <laughs> I definitely touch myself at night. So we're back. We're definitely recording. And we're going to see Sarah versus Papa. Sarah's getting sent to losers by Fizzle in winter semis. Papa getting sent here by the boy in winter semis. Is this best of five? Um, I want to see a best of five. I think we have a time for it. I would like a best of five. Um, I think, because this is funny, because this is for third and fourth. Yeah. Like, loser gets fourth. Hey, Nate, is this best of five? Can we, gentlemen? Everybody wants it. Because it's for money. It's third and fourth. Fans want it. It is for money. It's for money. Woo! We in there, boys? Money fives, baby. Let's do it. Money fives. Start at Battlefield. Whoa, whoa. Oh, wow. Papa's letting him go to Battlefield? I mean, I get he knows that I love it so much, so he'll never let me go there, but... I don't know, man. Maybe like, not given the respect to the Sarah Fox. Maybe not. Dude, but Papa knows better than anybody. The Ice Climber's uh, full jump up air doesn't reach the top platform. Really? So Gus could just camp that top platform. He could get the lead. Set up shop there, if you will. And just kind of hang out. Well, hang out for a on the ice. Oh, there. That was nice. Uh, he went to try to give Popo instead of uh, taking the potential free kill on Nana. And that was nice. Oh, doesn't get the ground handle. Shining it a little bit too late. Shining it back towards seven. Hmm. He's back, and there's the grab. Yeah, and there it is. Yeah, going nice. Right. I feel like going high might have been a bit better, or going to ledge. But going right towards the spider is like, Papa has two good reactions. Like, he's not going to, oh, man. You got to dash attack, or uh, you got to dash attack away, or on the free grab. The thing I've definitely nice noticed, it's probably pretty obvious about Papa's play. This control of the center is just one of the three games. It's just kind of almost impeccable. I mean, his neutral game is definitely where he shines. Exactly. He's a really smart player, and like we were talking about earlier, he can adapt very well. I mean, that's why I wanted the best of five. Yeah, like, he's, he has a very, um, like, strategic approach to the game, whereas a lot of people just go by feel. Oh, yeah, that's, I'm one of those people. I just go ham all day. I think he's asking you so many questions, like, what do you got to do? Yeah. And if you really want to get good at this game, that's how you think about it. Absolutely. He's done a lot of studying. He's got a big lead right now. He can really just... Playing safe now. Ooh, for the separation with the shine, but he's bringing it back with the. Oh, oh my god, what? Oh, Nana. Dang. Nana getting oh in there! Nana getting in there! He gave it to him twice in a row. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. That was so crazy. we've been talking about Papa's adjustments here, but Sarah looks like the one who needs to adjust here. Yeah, yeah. I definitely can't say you're wrong there. You can't say you're wrong there, Dilly. He gets in with there with a shine. But he's, he was a bit timid in uh, trying to. Oh, he missed the shine. At this point, like, just nair her. Like, if she gets hit, she's gonna go into a tumble, and there's no way that Papa can save her. Great shine. Alright, he finally, he finally killed her. And as long as he plays patiently and doesn't rush this kill, he should be able to kill Popo without taking, like, any percent. You should, you should, but Papa's Sopo is uh, pretty on point. His Sopo is scary. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Definitely not. You don't want to see his Sopo in a dark alley tonight. <laughs> Alright, we get Randy. Right. And this is really not that bad. Like, he's one shine away from evening it up. Yeah. Dude, that's, that's the rough part about this matchup. It's just like, either one of you could die literally at any point. Good movement up until there. He's playing this platform pretty well. One thing that Gus is really good at is picking the right tech option as a reaction to what it looks like you're going to cover. Ooh, and separation doesn't again. take the kill on mana. Yeah, you can't do that. You have to kill mana whenever you have mana. I think it, it kind of looked like she might have just died without him doing anything. Oh, great combo from the grab. Quick kill there. And quite the hell to climb for Fox. But, like, it's not it's not impossible. Like, nope. Resaw come back against Icy. It's, it's rough, but if you play patient enough, it's you know, going to happen. Yeah, exactly. And then just outplay Sopo. Oh, that was... Alright, he you matches out. That's important. Yeah, I agree. I mean, <laughs> nice up tilt. Bears. Goes up there forward to that, why not? Nice now a very nice the backer. Stage, but getting separated. Nice. So again, if he can like play this stock super he's well. Play, yeah, he's played his last stock incredibly well. When getting that was nice. His great movement dash. has been impactful. I do think he's got a lot of great dash dancing going on, but if he would incorporate a bit more lasers, not only tack on percent, but force Papa to want to approach that would help out. He's going to need every percent. That was solid. Nice yeah. shine, and there it is. Okay, so now let's just do that Definitely twice even more. It's more doable now. Yeah, it's looking more doable. Long shot, but still on. doable, for sure. The that thing is, the, the really key thing is he still has four minutes. I don't want to see him rush anything. Um, In a weird way, like, 
it, it almost would kind of make Papa want to be the one to approach, even though there's yeah. no reason for him to do so. Like I mean, yeah. Oh, you he got a drill? Oh, he uh, jumped right into Papa's loving arm. Oh, there. boy! So, for a lot of these full jump approaches, especially when they get knocked down like that, I like to offer running shine, because it's faster than full jump approaches, and um, it, it's just, it's so good. So, um, I think I think that like just running in with a shine would have been way safer, way quicker, more effective. Um, and that's, that's definitely something just in neutral that we need to see more from Gus. Yeah, that was a crazy grab. I didn't even, I didn't even, I don't think I pressed good. But it worked out. So, Dreamland, um... I'm excited to see more platforms. Oh my god, here from Sarah. Dude, he just stood on the platform. Yeah. He's, he's making technology him out. from your boy. That was a, that, that's exactly what he needs to do. I mean, that's the matchup. You want to talk about learning, you want to talk about Justin. There it is. But, okay, he's back. Ooh, kind of. So he's kind close. of back. Making it difficult. Alright, alright, he's back. Oh man. This is this isn't free. Every like, every oh, single percent Soho gets here. Like in your so head, you're like, okay, okay, I killed Nana, like, let's go. But Papa is just that's part not going to give up. That's part of the mind game. Because then it's almost like when you're like a wide receiver in the NFL and there's like a wide open pass, it's almost harder to catch it when there's no reason not to catch it than if there's like people all over you. And this is kind of like that moment. Like, you know, like, alright, it's just a freaking so far. You need to shine back here. Oh, nice bait. Like, I should be able to do that. Just a midget with a hammer. I have a laser. Come on. And, and again, that's actually a really good point. We could, we could see a bit more of the laser from Gus. Like, he doesn't have to approach it. Oh, that was a great turnaround up, though. Love to see that. Great back air. Not the best DI, and that's it. Alright, there he goes. There's a lead. First one. Yeah, and 73% is still not a terrible percent for Fox. 110% yeah. is probably a terrible percent yeah. for Fox. <laughs> The thing is, like, percents almost don't matter in this matchup. Like, to an extent they do, like, they help out with wobbling, but you could die at any percent no matter which side the match is gone. That even... That was nice. Oh, that was such a good shine! But he keeps getting hit by Nana's invincibility on that upbeat. Great running shine. Get the shine on Nana. Oh, good back air, but Papa's too smart and saves her just in time. He's so good at saving Nana, dude. It's absurd. Again, oh, I don't know why that happens. I feel bad every time. Nice back air. Gus's edge guarding has been on point. This should be a kill. He can be charging up smash. He can be charging F smash. And that's such a heartbreaker. makes it back. Because this is all just free damage. But he gets it. So now I think it's definitely crucial for him to play the platform to yes. and not get lost. Dude, he needs to only approach when he has like a read or a reaction on an icy C stink that didn't work out. Yeah, absolutely. Like approaching when they're together is, is scary. Yes. That's, that's a lot of hammer to take to the face. <laughs> like I never wanted to play the matchup that way, but I realized like there's no reason not to just play as safe as possible. And then, a lot of these matchups with the peaches, with the ices, the passive biding your time play is knowing when to change from being passive to being the same thing. That's like where like I think that is taking the stock constant to play. This is definitely still not over. Um, but now Gus has absolutely no reason to approach. Just wave dash and laser. And okay, Nana's not quite dead. Oh, he needed that. That would have been the game. Just, just like that, zero percent. Oh my god! Just like that, we're one interaction. Like, oh, he, gets out of he gets out of there. That was so big. He needs it again, though. He doesn't get the SBI no. that time. Dang. Well, now we're pretty much even That's again. Because after he, a such a big lead, he got the SBI on that regrab the first time and rolled away. But then he immediately approaches again, and uh, that's when we're gonna see this. And this game was literally like one interaction away from him killing Nana with three socks, and you know how just gonna rock. <laughs> there it is. Saves her again. Gets the back air. Gets another back air, that's it. And that's the game. Wow, great stuff. Great adjustment there. Yeah, he played that so calmly, so well. And we're seeing a game. Didn't get flustered by getting killed there. Yeah, I think it's really important that he got that game. Going down 2 0 in a best of 5 is not what you want. Because then you have to reverse sweep. No one wants yeah. to do that. So this is where Papa took me when he noticed that I was playing that patient platform game. Yeah. And um, it's pretty obvious why he would do that. Now they're going to be on more of a level playing field. Gus is definitely going to have to focus a lot, in my opinion, on um, mixing up how he drifts when he approaches with his full jumps. Um, 
of course, he's going to like his running shine approaches, but if he comes in with a jump, he can't always try to space it where they are. He has to sometimes go past them. Oh, no, baby. Oh. Not like this. <laughs> Not like this, baby. Yeah. Oh, man. A quick lead to pop. Yeah, but it can, it can get eviscerated just as quickly as it you know, was created. Got to take a little stretch time, you know, get loose. I like it. I like it. I think he should have kept his dash dance uh, in response to that side knee so he could have just done a running shine. He kind of stopped walking and then it was kind of an awkward movement to, to get the follow up. Yeah. This is a uh, nice running shine. Oh, I think he missed the L cancel because of like hitting both the shield. I hate that. So, I, we've said it before in the set, but now is really the time for a safe play for Fox. I mean, yeah. rushing into these approaches now. I, and, and truthfully, I like coming in with uh, Dare instead of Nair because, like, sure. even if you come up really high, you can just drill through the shield and get your shine. You don't yeah, have to worry about, like, waiting and doing a really late uh, Nair, which is kind of scary. You love the spinny kicks. You're dude, all the about spinny kicks. kicks. As a former Falco man, dude, the spinny <laughs> kicks, they just... Former Falco man. Yeah, yeah, I, I, Falco I, I, sucks, dude. <laughs> <laughs> this is news to me. All right, Falco, back to the game at hand. Back to the game. We'll, we'll, we'll get, get to that nonsense later. <laughs> Oh, missed shine opportunity. Running shine, back another up. running shine. Two shines. Problem is, both of them, sent, it, the third one in a row sends them all in the same direction. Oh like, my man. gosh, just can't get the separation. What just happened? Oh, there it is. He has to get the back air. So, so many of these opportunities, he's trying to go for shines on Nana, where back air would kill just as well. And back air is so much easier to lose. Oh boy. Okay, he needs this. So, okay, that's nice. There's no way he can favor it. There's no way. Yeah, he wanted to. Up there. Wait for it. Oh, he was a little anxious. Get with anyone? Okay. Now this is much more doable. Yeah, more we're doable. we're one interaction away from him to beat that up. Text in place. Okay. I don't know how those missed. Both take it. Magic most. Walking with the shine. Gets another one. Oh, great separation. Oh, there is a great shine. He's got to get back though. Oh, he wow. rides the wall to end two. Gotta love that. The angle. Okay. Great spot touch down smash. That was nice. He can't force us. You kind of—I I could tell he wanted that shine so bad, but you can, you can tell that he knows he has to play a bit more patiently. Wow. And there he di's the down punish. throw in. He needs to di it out. As much as it sucks to di something out when you're on the ledge, like if you don't di their down throw in, it's just a free—it's um, a free down smash every time. Okay, nice, Randy. It'll be interesting to see which part of the stage he favors going into this, because he definitely doesn't have a lead, obviously. So he needs to play safe. So does he want to try to control the middle? Or does he stay out of line where he can, you know? I kind of like him staying here and baiting them to the edge because if he can get around them and shine them, then that's that's a quick kill. Yeah, that was Thanks an opportunity. Nice. Oh, oh never. It, looked, it kind of looked like like one of the ice timers like hit him with a really weak move that got got like yeah, an edge cancel. Just just a little push. Just a little push. Okay. That's all it takes. So Gus Gus has a counter pick. Yeah, Yoshi's Taking Island. Taking the Yoshi's, Yoshi's Island. Yoshi's Island, let's do this. <laughs> Gentlemen, not sure. See, story right. is interesting. I'm not sure how I well, feel about it. Now we get to see more of the platform. But, I mean, that's true. Of. That's definitely true. And you have the top platform, but yeah. um, importantly, I like the stage because they're, they're like, um, full jump up there does reach the top platform, unlike Battlefield, unlike right. Dreamland. Gus keeps like challenging their up B, like particularly he's trying to hit Nana, and Nana has invincibility. So what you need to do is just wait for them to get through it, and then hit Popo or hit Nana when she's like done moving. Oh, I thought I was on the that's, that's quick that's response. Sucks. All right, well, two SDs and we're back to this. <laughs> Top notch melee. <laughs> It's almost as though Papa gave him an honor stop. <laughs> there we go, we'll just say that. He clearly meant to do that. Really sportsmanlike stuff. Oh, um, no out SDI from Gus. And then completely unsportsmanlike stuff coming out. Oh, oh boy. I mean, there was going to be no sportsmanship when Icy. No, yeah. It's just a big middle finger. Of course. Not that this commentary is biased. <laughs> no, no. no. Ooh, great shine separation. Nice. Good kill on Nash. He's going to get back. Get that shy guy out of the way. Important. Ooh, See there, there. Here. So the last time that that happened, he wasn't able to get the follow up because he stopped dash dancing. There, he just keeps dash dancing, waits, and gets the follow up. That's the other nice thing. running shine. Again, though, he's he trying to shine Nana in back air. Wow, goes for the punish on Nana. Oh. 
That way that didn't grab. Oh my god, he's styling on him! Oh man, he's blowing him over the edge! That is disrespectful. Just rude! Now, can he get the SCI down to tech the edge? That would be sick. I would probably I would scream my pants. Okay, we're not Not even close. It's so hard to know when he's gonna hit you, too. Yeah. That's another thing. So this Alright, is... well, we've seen this situation before. Yeah. <laughs> that, that's good. That's good. Yeah, he's it. He's moving. He, he's not picking it. Yeah, there it is. Of the stage. Now he's faced with the sofa. Which has given him problems before, for sure. Yeah, but all things are very preventable. It's like not dying down the matches, or, or down throws, rather. So yeah. that's good. 0.3%. Definitely manageable. He needs one perfect stock, and then he just needs some cheese. <laughs> we all need a little cheese in our lives. Absolutely. Oh, I like this uh, non-committal, like, but very uh, threatening approaches. Yeah, definitely trying to get in the mind games there with this movie. I like it a lot. Yeah. He shines on. He's getting face. a lot of shines. But he's not getting enough off. Yeah, the shines are Oh, Nana kind of messes up against a foreigner anyway. He goes for short and he's back. There's no platform. Papa calls out his movement so hard with that up there. Very nice. This is going to be tough to get back. Running shine. He needs a shine poke. And this is rough. He gets the, the gust nice angle. Nice shine. Wow. I like this. Dude, shield. They, now they now have no shield. They have no shield. Mm, yeah, this is rough. But look at all those personas. Does he get the re yeah, He's out of there. He gets a shine forward smash. Shine Santa. Oh, oh, oh my God! What's happening? No fucking way. Absolutely, dude. Oh, oh no, no, okay. Dude. I can't believe it. That was that was kooky. Oh, that was yeah, that was entertaining. Definitely. 